This is widget box. So I'm going to show you how easy it is to create a widget using widget box. I'm going to go to this little section titled make a widget. So a widget is a widget but for your blog. So all you have to do here is just enter the URL to your blog. I'm going to use the URL to my blog as an example. Once you make your widget, you can share it with other people. And now here, as you can see, once this page loads, you get the option to decide how your widget is going to appear. So you can choose a layout to be horizontal. So here's the preview on the right side. Or you can make it vertical. And you can choose a theme. So let's say I want my widget to be orange. I'm going to have an orange color widget. You can choose what you want to display. If it's going to be headlines only, headlines and articles. Uh, you definitely might want to put a title to your widget. So you might include a caption. And you can even include an image to your widget. I don't. I have not uploaded any images, so I'm just going to use one of these um, just default icons right here. It's like a little person. This is going to be above the title of my widget. might want to include a description you can include some tags for your widget and once you're done you just go to where it says uh, public publish widget And in a little while, you'll ha have a complete widget. So my widget is done now. And I can get my widget. And I can choose what I want to do next. If I want to get the widget code, or if I want to share it maybe in a social network website such as Facebook, MySpace, you can add it to Blogger. There's also more options if you click or say see more. And you get to decide there where you want to add the widget. So you could go to add to iGoogle. So I'm going to close that for right now. Any selection you make from there is actually straightforward. So you just click it and from there it's straightforward. Let's see what other options you have. You can go to my widgets. And here it lists all the widgets you've created. And if you click it, you can see how many people have uh, clicked your widget and gone to your website so it tells you the total number of hits so this is just a little preview of widget box and just to show you how easy it can be to make a widget without necessarily knowing how to do programming and as you can see from the step by step what we were doing is very fairly simple but it doesn't have to take several minutes to do